day-to-day -day basis, it's it's always it's changing all the time. So that's why I kind of typically do a daily drive around and just make sure and see anything that's different, what changed, what needs to be changed, or what needs to be taken care of. So, yeah, I mean, it's definitely in way better condition at this time than it was last year, compared to last year. Number six. So one of the few holes that we renovated last year. We had to get a little more tea and ground and stuff, so it's definitely a big improvement, and guests really enjoy it. So, And the native is going hog wild with all the rain that we've had. This is the thickest and longest this native has been in years. Of course, chemical free because we sit on Coors Brewery Aquifer. More of a natural environment and a way to maintain and manage a golf course, really, without relying on certain chemicals that take care of your issues. We are on hole seven, par five, slight dog leg to the left. Kind of a challenge, risk reward, there's a little Brick that runs in front of the green about 20 yards short. Part of my water system, how I get my water to my main irrigation pond. And I have a head gate that I manually open and close and operate to fluctuate or increase, decrease the water that I have, that I like to have for my ponds. He's mowing the 17th fairway. So the mechanic keeps the blades sharp all the time. He's always grinding them, uh, touching them up daily to make sure that uh, everything is cutting to how it should be and the height of cut is in good condition and that it just looks good. 